What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's reaction video is going to be the active military manpower comparison of 2021. 140 countries are about to be ranked. Um, I'm probably not going to know a few of them. There's going to be a few gems in there which maybe you guys think I should know, but my geography isn't the best, uh, so I might learn a few new countries in this. Uh, but this is literally, I believe, just the active personnel in an army. Like the ones, if you were to call the army today, you'd have that many troops, Point A, let's go, we're trained, we're ready to go. You know what I mean? Obviously, the US is going to be up there. China's going to be up there. I didn't realise India were going to be up there, but India's going to be up there, which is probably a mental thing to say because obviously they've got a ridiculous population, but I did not know their military was built up as much. That's just me not knowing. Um, so places like that are definitely going to be high on the list. Now, I want to make a prediction of the UK. Just because, you know, I am British. I take pride in knowing things about Britain, but I don't know much, to be honest with you. Um, my guess would be, we reacted to a video the other day which said, I think we were the eighth best military in the world. According to this one video, I'm not saying we are, um, but we're talking about active personnel. I feel like because of our history and our infrastructure, we definitely ranked higher than some countries potentially with more personnel, would be my guess. So I'm going to guess, um, I'll guess ninth. I guess that the UK is ninth on this list. I may be wrong. Let's check it out. I've offered for a while. Hit that like button, guys. I'd really appreciate it. The more you hit that like button, the more I know you want to see this type of content. Hit that subscribe button if you're new around here. Videos every single day. And let's check out the active military personnel from every country. Well, from 140 countries. I thought it was just going to be one then. <laughs> Suriname, 2000. Is that an army? In the 21st century, is that an army? I mean, fair play to the 2000, though. Right? That's, that's a lot more respect than whatever ever I can get because I do not have a ball for it, but fair play. Montenegro, okay, 2000. Right, we're at Gabo on five, five. We're starting off super, super small. To be fair... If only, this is probably going to show like the massive gap as well from all these smaller countries, just like how ridiculous that gap is, not only in weapons supply, just the personnel, but just don't have the manpower, which again, 5,000 people is quite a lot of people, but I know some of the numbers, which the staggering numbers which are coming up. So I'm just like, yeah, uh, that's literally nothing. It's a peanut pod. Okay, we're almost into um, 10,000s. Bhutan, I didn't expect Bhutan to have that many, to be honest. Uh, not Macedonia, that's a surprise as well to me. Maybe not to you guys, but to me, definitely. I thought I was just, oh, oh, not yet, not yet. Subscribe, hit that subscribe button, guys. Oh, Ireland. You know what, fair play to Ireland. I genuinely would, my guess would have been Ireland would have had more than 9,000. I just said a lot more. Obviously, I'm completely wrong. That is very surprising to me. Um, yeah, very surprising. New Zealand only 9,000. Wow. That's mad. Namibia has more. Conga has more. Wow. The New Zealand, that's incredible. Actually, think about it. I know I've paused a lot. I know New Zealand isn't the biggest island in the world, but still. You know what I mean? It's just more of a, a well-known nation. And maybe that maybe, that maybe that's where it's coming from. My geography sucks. Just being more of a well-known nation. Wow, oh, Bosnia, 10,500 as well. Like, we've hit, we've hit 10,000 and we're slowly stalling. It's hardly going up now. Madagascar, 13,000. What? That's actually quite mental for Madagascar, surely. You wait, quite. I didn't think it would be that high, to be honest with you. Okay, there we go. We, the top 40, the first 40, um, 
I think only Ireland and New Zealand are really the main surprises. A few countries I didn't expect to have as many after seeing some of the others, uh, but not too, too many. I we're about to see Denmark. That's definitely Denmark, isn't it? That's a surprise. 99. I wouldn't have guessed that. Definitely not. Yo, Somalia. 20,000. Wow. New Tamala? I, I think that's how you say it. 20,000. Fair play. That's quite a lot for them. Turkmenistan. Turkmenistan? Is that like just Turkey? But the name of the army? <laughs> I probably sound like an idiot. Let me know. <laughs> I probably sound like a right idiot. <laughs> Austria 22,000. Kenya's up there as well. Okay, fair play. El Salvador. Wow. Getting into a few of the more well-known nations. Now we're getting down to like the top 80 and stuff like that. Up to 30,000 though. Oh, never mind. I just said get to the more well-known and Laos comes. <laughs> Not a very well-known one, obviously. I surely like... We're going to be getting pretty high top 20s. I imagine that's when you're going to like proper jump up. Sweden, okay, 30,000. Belgium, not bad. Getting outrun by Libya, though. Wow, that's quite a surprise. To me, at least. And Chad, again, that's, to me, that's so surprising. Tunisia, fair play. Tunisia punching, man. They're definitely punching up there. Wow. Alright, we're getting close to 50,000. Uganda, fair play. Yo, keep on 50,000. I'd have never guessed that, man. Like, wow. I just put a thought they didn't put them on the list. Australia, 60,000. Outranking New Zealand by loads. Wow, Romania up there. Fair play. Canada, Singapore, we're going to start getting to the bad, like the big, big boys soon. Wow, like we've suddenly just gone on a massive jump as well. We're increasing a lot more. Like Peru, 90,000, I'd never get... No, oh, give... Nepal has 95,000. Seriously? What? How big is Nepal? Like, I know quite a bit about Nepal, actually, to be honest with you. I did, like, a, a bit of charity work for Nepal, building schools and stuff. I didn't go over there, but we did a lot of fundraising events. I would have never... I don't actually know how big it is, personally. I would have never guessed 90,000. Wow. That's incredible. 95,000. What? Yeah, we're starting to see the big jumps. Poland, for just 120,000 beasts is what it would be. <laughs> Cambodia, wow. 125,000, incredible, man. I, I wouldn't have guessed that either. Philippines is up there as well. Doctor, I know that isn't doctor. <laughs> I know that isn't doctor. Oh, I said doctor. I'm gonna get roasted. I was about to. I was trying to do a joke. Doctor Congo. 
<laughs> oh, I'm going to get absolutely roasted. <laughs> Hi, right, what? 165,000, man. I'm honestly so shocked with some of these numbers. Hey, yeah, it's 170,000. Wow. Afghanistan, 175, okay. Oh, no! I mean, I'm proud of our attempts. But there's... There's 28 more. I said ninth. Oh, I'm 20 places off. That's quite embarrassing. On a list of 140 countries, I should have really been at least within 10. You know what I mean? Especially when I'm talking about United Kingdom. 28 countries have more active personnel. I mean, it makes sense. We're not the biggest population. To be fair, I don't know why I said ninth. <laughs> Probably a right idiot doing that. Wow, I would never have guessed 29th. I should, to be fair, when I saw Islands, I should have known we were in for a low number. Wow. I've n uh, not to be disrespectful if you're from Eritrea. I've never heard of them. Never in my life heard of them. And um, they don't care. That does not matter to the world. But they've got 200,000. They've got more than the UK. Wow, that's incredible. I need to learn about it. Like, me not knowing about it, I'm not being like, oh, you shouldn't be above us. I'm shocked. I'm like, fair play. Wow. Greece up there. Okay, makes sense. Bangladesh. Oh, I didn't think about that. I, know, I don't know much about Bangladesh. Sri Lanka. Oh, Japan. I should have... We were definitely higher than ninth. <laughs> Ukraine, fair play. But yeah. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't realise France actually outdid us by so much. Wow. Colombia, 300 fat Morocco. Wow, I never expected that. Damn, Brazil got quite a lot as well. And this raise your fair play. Oh, okay. I, I, again, I paused this video loads, so I apologise if I've annoyed you. But I've also made myself look like an idiot loads. As this is, I said, maybe you've won stood for Turkey. I was completely wrong. <laughs> oh, I sound like such an idiot. <laughs> Wow, man. I'd have never guessed that. Egypt. Okay, fair play. Hey, in Saudi Arabia, 10. Vietnam has that many? Oh, I, I had no clue. What? Six hundred thousand in South Korea. I guess, you know what, I guess the South Korea one makes sense because now I'm thinking about it. They have requirements that everyone has to do training and I guess that when they're doing the training and I like do a week's duty, that's active personnel. I think the South Korea one is literally because they forced them to do it. I think I think so anyway. Pakistan, yeah, I, I should have guessed Pakistan up there as well. Russia and millions, man. Not a surprise at all. North Korea's 1.3 million. Again, that must be the whole similar to South Korea because obviously North Korea is just an uh, anomaly, isn't it, to the world? It's just a closed off place. Nobody knows much about it. Nobody knows much about the rest of the world in there. Um, maybe I'll just force them all to do it. I don't know what North Korea's population is, but 1.3 million is a lot. The United States is third. Wow. So the UK is, is tied third. Legends. Absolute legends. <laughs> India's up there, yeah. I guess India, man. Got to be China. We haven't seen China yet, have we? Yeah, China's up there. Fair play. What a jump. What a jump that is. Wow, I hope you guys have enjoyed this reaction. China, not surprised at all. I didn't realise the jump were that big, but not surprised up there. The top three, I think anyone could have really guessed it. Um, yeah, it's been a bit of a different reaction. Just a bit of music and me watching a video and chatting. 
I hope you guys have enjoyed it anyway, because I've really enjoyed it. I've learned new countries. I've made an idiot out of myself. I've paused too many times. I've done all sorts in this video. So it's had it all. Whatever you like, you've probably got it there. Smash that like button if you have enjoyed it, guys. Smash that subscribe button as well. You absolute legends. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.